Hi everyone, it's me, Darlene. I am in my bathroom. I am about ready to cut my hair. The last time I cut my hair was, I just looked back on YouTube. It was seven months ago because I did a video for that. I'll actually link to that one if you want to see it. So it has been seven months since any of this has been cut in the back. And it's just so scraggly. I mean, I just don't like it. I mean, what is there to like? Absolutely nothing. My bangs have been trimmed a couple times. One time, actually, by Skylar. If you remember that, I'll link back to that video, too. Skylar is my granddaughter. She was only six at the time, and we did this funny little twist and cut bang thing, and she also dyed my hair. She did a good job with the dyeing. So, tonight, and I don't have great lighting, so I don't know how this is going to come out because I waited too long and now it's dark out. Tonight I'm gonna cut, and I'm cutting, I wanna cut pretty short, like, I don't know if it'll even touch my shoulders. We don't know until I'm done because I'm not a professional hair cutter. So, <laughs> I just have always cut my own hair and I'm pretty sure I always will. And then the next thing is I will be dyeing it to get rid of all the gray. But I figure I'll cut first and that'll get rid of a lot of hair so my dye will feel like more in my head. Okay, first I have to go wash a uh, rinse. Uh, my hair is clean, but I just, I gotta get it all wet. So I'll be right back. Oh, I just cannot believe how much gray there is. I don't know. All right. I am so, like, really not in the mood to do this, and I should be in the mood because it's not that I do a better job if I'm in the mood, but I accept big mistakes better <laughs> if I'm in a good mood. It's always scary. I am not going to explain how I'm doing this because you probably should not try this at home. But I just pick up the hair and I just start to cut. Put my little basket right here. And I'm just going to go around and do that. Try to get it done all around my head. Oh, I just hope that I can do a somewhat good job because I'm telling you, I am tired of this hair. This dye that I have is just one that I happen to have on hand. It is medium rich brown. So I guess I'll be going with that. I did blackish brown last time. Let's see. Now, as for the bangs, I was going to do the twist, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to go. I am so tired of these bangs hanging in my face. You don't know how much I hate bangs that hang in the face. I'm going to get them short. Shall I sing? La, 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 la. I shan't. <laughs> Holy Toledo, I'm cutting off what feels like a ton of hair. Okay, I'm not going for the mullet look. So, we got to start cutting around the bottom now. Oh, gee whiz. Oh, I got to decide. I have to decide how long. Okay, well, let's get rid of this guy. That's significant. Do the same on this side. That might not be a bad length right there. I got some. Oh my goodness! Hair cutting for me is always like a two-day job because I do some of it now, then I fix it tomorrow. I wish so much I could just take my head off and put it in front of me so I could layer all the way I want to layer. I should have showed you the back. Let's look at the back. See, kind of long and uh, well, except for where, <laughs> where I just cut. So all that has to go like to here. Let me see again. Here we go. Oh. Yikes. -o. Mm. All right. Back with the glasses on. All right. So 
I really would like to layer this out. It is, it's so thick in the back. And, um, I don't know. Let's just go for it. Let's try to get some layering done here. Making a mess and all over the sink. I know some of you cut your own hair because you said so last time. You know, they say if we cut our hair, we should put the hair outside for the squirrels and other wildlife to use in their nests. Oh, this is so hard. Eh. Look at this. I'm not the... I don't think they teach that method of layering in hair school. All right, so let me just pick some up here. I should have some clips or something so I can hold the parts that I've already cut, but that would make too much sense, wouldn't it? I think a blow dry is the secret to any hairdo. It always looks all right after you blow dry, I hope. Well, it certainly feels better. See, I was actually, I was actually wanting like shorter. I was kind of like wanting it, but I probably shouldn't mess with it too much. All right, let me do my slight, my fancy trimming with my own invented method. Oh, and I left a long one there. There. Straight up without cutting the eye. Not good to cut the eye. That doesn't go back. There is a lot less hair there. All right, let's look at the back. Oh my God. <laughs> I kind of went a little short on the top. Alrighty. I don't even know if you guys can still see me. <laughs> wow. I mean, for just chopping, that wasn't too horrible of a job. I kind of got lucky. I mean, I see a little bit here and there that could, this, I think this part right here could be a little bit shorter. So let's just grab that and cut the tip of that off. And we shall look again. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got. Scared. <laughs> I wish I could do it. Oh, like the hand. I am going to do some blow drying and see what we've got. Obviously went shorter in here than I wanted. I would have liked a little bit more hair there, but it'll be probably exactly what I want in a couple weeks. I'm going to try to um, dry it for real, and I'll be right back. Oh my! Oh my God! Well, you know what? This is like very 80s. Kind of like it. I think I do. I got crooked bangs. I can take care of that. Little snip snip here. Snip snip there. And like I said, tomorrow there'll be wisps of things sticking out that I can take care of. I haven't looked at the back. Ow. And yes, I put a little bit of foundation on because my face was so red, as always. Okay, let me look at the back here. Oh, this is ridiculous. And I'm so hot. Why didn't I open that? Oh, right away. I was trying to comb with the handle side. You know, when I dye it, it's going to feel so much better because it gives body to the hair. And, uh, all right, let's just go look at the back. I think 
I'm absolutely fine with that for tonight. Got a little bit of a roundedness on the bottom. I like that. Alright, it's not what I envisioned in my head. I was wanting it like shorter, like really tapered in, and but longer here. So when the sides grow out just a little bit, then I could maybe cut shorter. Okay, let's see if I can get it where I like it here. Do I like it at all? Why am I still so hot? <sighs> See, I don't like the gray on the sides. <laughs> okay, my last haircut I ended up liking right away. This one, gonna take some getting used to. Because this part right here, see how short I chopped that? But that's okay. I don't know if I should keep making this side shorter to match. Probably should. Might as well have two sides that I don't like. Or maybe I should just leave it alone. Look, I'm going to wear it behind my ears. And then when I dye it, that gray will be gone. I don't like that. I wasn't so freaking hot. Okay, I think I can live with this. What do you think? <laughs> That's about as good as it's going to get for me tonight. And my back is absolutely killing me and I am so hot. So I'm going to go sit down and edit this lovely video. And I'll be back with more soon. Thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate it. You don't know how much I appreciate it. Bye.